Welcome! Today we're going to take a look at Vimium C for Firefox, and it's also available on Chrome. I use it in both browsers. Um, it's going to help you navigate your browser, do a whole bunch of stuff in the browser without needing to take your hands off the keyboard. Before we do that, a few ways to support the channel. Best way, number one, uh, become a member, curtismichael.ca slash membership. Uh, members that get all my courses included, or if you just want to take a single course, curtismichael.ca slash education. Let's dive in and take a look at Vimium C. So this is Vimium C. Uh, you can see I have the remove button because I already have this installed, so I don't uh, need to do it. If you don't, then you hit install, uh, and it will be in your browser. It'll ask you for some prompts on, you know, what permissions are. Can it work in um, in private tab stuff like that? So let's demonstrate what it does by going to my site first. And one of the things it does, if I press F, I can now press W and open up that link. I can press Shift H to go back. If I press capital F and W, it opened it in a new tab. And I'm using Shift, J, and K to navigate between tabs. If I want to close that tab, I can hit X and close the tab right there. So that's one of the big things it does is it lets you navigate your browser um, without needing to uh, take your hands off the keyboard. I can just leave it right where it is or like leave my hands on the keyboard and do that. Another thing it does is scrolling the Vimway. So if I go J and K, I'll go up and down, which is excellent. Uh, it just, again, means I don't have to hit space, which often moves too far, right? If I go uh, GG, go to the top, which is, again, this is the standard Vim shortcut. And if I hit space, you can see right now I have read more right here. So if I was reading this last line, I hit space. It is now off the screen and I can't see it. That's the one right there. Excellent ergonomic keyboard primer, right? Space, can't see it. So if you're reading an article and I'm trying to read the last couple lines, I say, oh, I'll scroll because I can't, you know, they're kind of getting cut off or scroll right here. New features or trying. Right, they're in there, barely one line, but I would prefer, again, GG to the top, to just scroll. I can scroll a little bit, read, scroll a little bit, read, and keep the reading window right in the center right here. Shift G will go to the bottom. Oh, we went back because I hit Shift H instead. So let's go forward and kill the history. So, um, yeah, hit G, capital G. Go all the way to the bottom, GG goes to the top. Again, these are standard Vim shortcuts. Another thing it does, if I press YY, so open up a new tab and paste, you can see it copied the URL of uh, the site I was on. Um, you can do lots of other things with this as well. Close the tab, if I hit, uh, was it shift and get a, a question mark? There's lots of other things, right? Capital or F gets you the uh, new tab, or opens the current link in the tab, current tab, capital F in the new tab, uh, I can scroll left, right, everything, right? Scroll all the way to the left, uh, scroll up, down. You can go by page. Um, there's lots of stuff. Copy the URL of a link. So I can just select a link and then copy that link to my clipboard. Uh, I can select text and copy it to the clipboard and then use the Vomna bar. That's another interesting thing. So if I hit O and then I'll press type D, and you can see it's going to search right here for DuckDuckGo. Uh, the other search engine set up for Google for sure. I don't know about the other ones. If I want to say stop all door uh, notifications and it's going to open it there and then I can hit shift F DK shift F cell and I have them right there and I'm using uh, J and K right shift J and K to go back and forth between my tabs so I can see them without getting my hands off the keyboard and again there's so much more you can use this uh, again in Chrome or in Firefox uh, and use this. I go in and look through all of this, right? Manipulating tabs. I can close tabs. So I can escape to get out of that. X to close tabs. It is an awesome tool and it saves me so much um, mouse work. So I was actually adding Redis to a whole bunch of our sites and having to navigate in and out of like 85 sites and edit files and a whole bunch of other stuff. And the best thing or the big thing is I didn't have to get off my uh, keyboard and touch my mouse at all because I had uh, Vimium C and I was operating in the terminal otherwise. So I could just type in what I needed, use all the commands, have it all scripted, and I could just get it all done. Now that's it. If you liked the video, thumbs up below. Give me a uh, subscribe, hit the bell, all that YouTube stuff. Uh, best thing to do, really, if you want to support the channel, see more videos, is uh, take a course, curtismichael.ca slash education, or become a member, curtismichael.ca slash membership. Now that's it. Have an awesome day.